Ready to wear braids this winter. <laughs> and so I realize it's not a very good idea, but at the same time, there are things that you could do to make your braids work better for you. Hi guys, <laughs> welcome back to my channel. So I'll be sharing my Beanie Took collection with you. In Canada, we call them Tooks. <laughs> my collection with you today so at the same time I'll be showing you how I style my chunky sweaters transitioning into winter so let's do this guys so we are starting off with a monochromatic look the monochromatic look is huge so this beanie this toque fits right into this chunky sweater theme because it's all gray i absolutely love this look and you would see another look that is very much similar to it the clutch is just a prop as a way of styling but of course you guys know we are in lockdown so we are not going anywhere but i wanted the braids to blend beautifully with the cardigan as well as the beanie. And this second styling look is just me. It's typical me where I always have to find a belt from my collection to cinch my waist because I am a belt person. But what I love about this cardigan is the combination of print, ah, oh, I really, really love this look. I love the contrast of the two different grays. That in itself is a great tip whenever you're trying to go monochromatic but doesn't want it to be too uniformed. So I really, really love the way this turns out. The belt was thrifted about four years ago. It's a piece from Vestier Collective. It's my YSL gorgeous number and it's something that is a forever piece in my wardrobe. Yes, for this second belting look, you know I have to add a broad belt because it's my signature look. I love a great broad belt. This piece is from Zara. You guys have seen it a million times. It's, it's going to continually be on repeat. So, yeah. Love it. four years ago I am pairing it with a very similar cardigan I love this cardigan it's like a sister to the first piece you just saw but this piece I definitely wear more often because I just love the gray tone of this particular piece and the fact that it's really really comfortable and I wear this piece uh, uh, it's very versatile and in the next video I'll likely show you the versatility of this piece but this is a really really gorgeous piece the toque I love it it's comfy when I'm wearing braids it's just that it can't be fitted over my weaving extension so 
I am glad that I'm definitely getting the wear out of it because I was actually never wearing this piece because it was too tight. It was way too snug, but it fits beautifully here. It definitely comprises of natural fibers, although there's no label indicating it. There's no stretch to the fabric, so it's a clear indication that it definitely comprises of natural fibers. So it's a really, really cute piece. I absolutely love the tribal Moroccan sort of look okay. to this piece. This is how it's supposed to look. <laughs> Not with the applique showing. Yeah. So the belt is another piece that was thrifted from Vestier Collective and I really love the combination of the tan and the grey. I think it's a really great colour combo and I love this look. to interrupt guys but just a quick note hi guys if you just so happen to just click on my video you are new please click the red subscribe button so here they are guys if you click on these buttons you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when I post new videos and most importantly guys it's free thank you so much for subscribing love ya let's get back to the video I also wanted to pair this same toque with this bag. Uh, that's one of my 2020 best finds. And hopefully that video would come soon. But yes, really, really love the combination of tan, purple. Uh, I've had this chunky sweater for over seven or eight years now so it's yeah it's a staple every single winter i bring it out and the ralph lauren boot is a piece that is about 18 years old and uh, i love it it's a gorgeous animal print just absolutely love this piece Number four, <laughs> believe it or not, I have no idea how it entered my closet. I think it belonged to my sister and it was left at my place, so it became mine. <laughs> but yeah, I love the beaded details on this piece. So I've decided to just pair it with this same chunky sweater and rock the same boots and I think this look is a very casual look that you just jump in the car to run an errand to grab your groceries minus the stilettos of course and the gorgeous bag but yeah you could pair this with a combat boot and that's coming right up These are the gorgeous beading details I absolutely love <laughs> about this toque. Number five is 
is my absolute favorite, guys. Wow. Apart from the vibrant color, it's 100% cotton. And it's a piece I've thrifted, actually, for over five years or so now. And it's the only piece, well, either the gray or this piece that I often read for every single winter. So, love it. The chunky knit that I'm pairing it with is a piece that is about, it's over 12 years old. When I got this piece, I really thought it was a natural fiber piece, but it turned out not to be the case. The style I absolutely love, and it's a piece that would never go anywhere because I absolutely love it. It's very flattering. It's gorgeous. Two Number six, this is the Ottawa Senators logo and I swear to God, I really don't know <laughs> how it's part of my collection, but I kind of know, yeah. But yeah, it's a piece I don't wear that often because I have another black one, as you have just seen, but it goes beautifully with this as well. I think it's that pop of red against the textured gorgeousness of this chunky sweater. Uh, and I love the way it fits on the head. It's a really great fit. So I really love this piece. However, it's definitely synthetic some fleecy material absolutely so to casualize this piece as i've mentioned earlier i brought out the chunky boot that i got last year thrifting it's the favorite piece oh, the doc martin piece and i'm pairing it with another thrifted piece that I absolutely love. This is a great casual look to definitely jump into those boots and run outside for any errands whatsoever. So I love this casual yet chic look. And I want you to keep in mind that most of these items, as mentioned, are synthetic in some form or the other and this is how you take care of your synthetic chunky knits and other items such as your toques as well as any socks and nylons that you wear throughout the winter season so guys i really enjoyed putting this lookbook together and i hope you have learned something i love you guys and i'll so, see you soon thank you guys so much for watching and remember to always love yourself accept your perfect imperfections because they are what make you unique and drop dead gorgeous hope you were inspired